Hi, my name is Alyssa Liang. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And as you can see from my holly jolly funky sweatshirt, this video is the only Christmas outfit video you'll ever need. That is a very bold claim, but I hope to do it justice. I'll try to cover all the bases. So if you want to see if I'm able to do it justice, please keep on watching. I'm going to be including outfits from my own closet like this one and outfits from Pinterest because sometimes I have good outfit ideas that I just can't execute because I don't have the pieces in my closet. We have a lot to cover so let's get started. I'm starting off with an absolute banger. Isn't it the coolest Christmas party outfit you've ever seen? I'm honestly sad I didn't come up with it for the Christmas party I just went to but that's that. So this first outfit consists of a silk button down layered under a corset top that like ties in the back and a white mini skirt. I decided to pair it with the white mini skirt so that that it all just blends in and it looks like a dress and it looks really cool wearing it with this like plain white bag but i think it will look really cool with a nice pop of color red clutch as well and i'm wearing it with knee-high boots because i think knee-high boots just look really freaking good with mini skirts corsets over button downs genuinely live in my head rent free i feel like i've been reusing this outfit combo in videos especially for the past like year and I think it's perfect for Christmas because sometimes a corset on its own, a little too much. Honestly, if I'm going for something even more conservative, I could pair it with a black pair of trousers, a black bag, black heels. This is the second fit. I'm once again wearing a silk button down, this time in red. Again, with a mini skirt, this time in black. I'm also wearing this bag crossbody because when I wear shoulder bags with like silk tops, it's inevitably going to just fall off my shoulder anyway. So I'm wearing it like this for practicality reasons. But I think it looks a lot better as a shoulder bag. I'm also wearing black black heels to make it like a formal more eveningy type of look i personally think that different types of fabrics like silk satin organza fur corduroy velvet suede and just like textured fabrics look really nice and festive and special so i just like this silk top it's low-key a little baggy on me and i would do like a half tuck moment if it weren't baggy on me but this isn't mine it's my mom's so yeah that's that i think it would work well for like evening type of vibes or dinner it would also work with like a clutch and yeah this is the third look it's a little over the top a little extra and i like it i love it like that so this is actually a top i wore this top on tiktok and people were like oh i love your dress it's actually like a really over the top peplum top instead of pairing it with shorts like i did on my tiktok i paired it with this interesting like skirt type of thing with like layers so that the fits like super layered and stuff i also tried to layer a little gold jewelry i'm bad at layering jewelry honestly and i'm wearing a clutch with it because i feel like a shoulder bag would just kind of ruin the vibe so clutch it is and honestly even if it's fully black and black isn't necessarily the most christmasy color i still really like it i just love anything with ruffles anything that looks extra for the holiday season the next category is family gathering and i'm wearing this tweed blazer because i think tweed in general like tweed sets the oldies love that type of thing you know it looks put together it looks formal it looks great especially like a red or green tweed set for christmas there's nothing more festive than that and i just absolutely love it it could give 90s chanel runway if executed properly so you do your thing um i personally do not own a tweed set because i don't see myself wearing it in my everyday life but i own this tweed blazer so i think this is a good substitute for that if this skirt is too short by all means wear pants but I just paired it with a black tank top and the skirt I wore for the previous outfit. Right now, I'm wearing it with heels again, but I have worn this fit with loafers in the past. It looks good as well. And then this black baguette bag. You can also wear this with stockings. The colors I'm wearing right now are not the most festive, but you can just substitute that. So yeah. This next look is definitely a safe option. It's just a top with bottoms and a bag. It's basic, but it works. I'm wearing this red puff sleeve top that's definitely too tight on me. It's kind of flattering. I kind of like it and I'm wearing it with a beige pair of pants as opposed to a white pair of pants or a black pair of pants because I feel like white would make this whole look too bright and black is too predictable. I feel like puff sleeves have a way of making you look sweet and kind and nice so that's that. It would look great color coordinated with a pair of red heels just saying. Merry Christmas I am the gift. This is actually the outfit I'm planning on wearing for my Christmas pictures. So I guess that's that. You know, spoiler alert, I guess if you've watched till this point in the video, you know what my Christmas pick outfit's going to be. If you know me, then you know that I like wearing anything that makes me look like a present. I like everything with over-exaggerated bows. I don't know why. I think it makes me look super cool, super cute. I paired it with a mini skirt, but you could totally pair it with like pants or something like that. I don't know why I'm super inclined to pair everything with mini skirts. You can wear it with like knee-high boots as well, but I just wear it with like probably heels or something okay we're now moving on to those more casual like going out type of fits this outfit might look boring to you it's literally just a skirt and a shirt 
but to me it's kind of special because i'm a pants girl i'm like a mini skirt girl i rarely wear long skirts so this long skirt moment is pretty special plus i wore heels with it i'm also wearing gold hardware which i don't usually wear but as you can see throughout this video i've been wearing like mostly gold because i think it gives off more of a christmasy vibe and if you want it to be more casual you can just wear it with a pair of sneakers or like chunky shoes i'm back and better than ever with the christmas colors this time i'm wearing green I'm just wearing this black like peplum long top with this pair of green jeans and i know it's not obvious but this is very strategic this pair of pants is too tight on me because i got the size too small so i usually wear it with like tops that are looser so it fits more comfortably like the fit isn't too like tight overall i think this fit looks really put together and really festive because of the pops of green and also the ruffles the peplum you know it just stands out so this is the next like going out type of fit this fits really casual but it's actually kind of funky because i mixed super casual pieces with pieces that like should probably be formal it's not your average like t-shirt and jeans i also added this red bag specifically to make it more christmasy because red we've already established it's a christmasy color also if you're wondering what my shirt says it says fragola and it quite literally just means strawberry in italian don't get it twisted i do not speak italian but I will continue to wear this shirt because I love strawberries and I love this shirt. We're now moving on to like the Christmas day itself outfits. I personally don't like dressing up that much for the day itself. I honestly just really enjoy the build-ups of Christmas. But if I did dress up, I feel like this would be a cute outfit. I feel like blue just gives off like wintry vibes. It's basically just a very cozy, chill look, elevated, and I like it. This next fit definitely isn't super festive. But I feel like without the pink bag, maybe it could work because it is still green. But I chose to wear it with like a pink bag and a pink pair of sandals because i feel like it just looks so much cuter that way so why would i not do that it's just this like casual top casual shorts sandals i don't know i just like dressing pretty casual on the day itself so this is the fit again with the like different types of fabrics brodery maybe festive i don't know in this execution it's not that festive but you get what i mean right last but not the least i have this outfit i never thought i'd be into the crossbody look again but i'm kind of into it because i feel like when the top is like super bulky it just like adds a little something to this area also if i wear this bag as a shoulder bag with this sweatshirt it just keeps rolling off my shoulder so it's a lot more practical again i'm just wearing this graphic sweater from glossier and then like a bag and maybe my favorite piece of clothing in the entire world a tennis skirt really basic but really cozy and chill which is exactly the vibe i try to go for on christmas now let's talk about outfits and clothing items that give off festive energy but like i just can't execute it myself because i don't have the clothing items so i'm gonna talk about them because maybe you can first article of clothing is like a chunky knit sweater i did wear one in the beginning but like there are tons of different types of chunky knits and you can style it all different ways i'm gonna like flash them on the screen right now it also adds a lot of texture and textures is another thing aside from different types of fabrics that could like really work to make an outfit look more festive some examples of texture are like ruffles lace trimming feathers embroidery stuff like that they just look good they just look festive next i want to reiterate that pretty much anything with a touch of red and green will look festive specifically i've been really liking the color burgundy and like the specific muted shade of green if you're being real the tldr of this video is that just add red or green to the outfit and it'll probably be festive last article of clothing i want to talk about is skinny scarves i've been seeing skinny scarves a lot on pinterest and they're definitely like a really trendy item and they're not classic at all but they look so cool they look so extra they look so unnecessary and i love them that is pretty much it for this video i hope you enjoyed i hope you got some inspo from my fits and the stuff i talked about if you did please don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel because it really helps also follow me on instagram at alisalian and on tiktok at alisa's vids if you want to see more of me that's it for me see you on the next one bye